We've heard it all about our public education system. There isn't enough money. Schools are overcrowded. Bad teachers can't be fired. Teachers just teach to the test and not for learning. <sighs> Whenever I hear that, I just shake my head. What we have to realize is that we don't value kids. Our children are not important enough to make them number one in our society. Schools, especially the neighborhood schools, have been the backbone of U.S. culture since the beginning. Now, teachers have near Herculean tasks trying to manage a daily dose of unprepared, underfed, unmotivated children whose parents have vacated the emotional premises of their kids, for whatever reason. Yes, thank goodness there are exceptions, but if we don't value every single child, every single child, we set up society as having to pay for a lot of bad things that are going to happen down the road. If we really want a better education for our kids so that they have the opportunities to reach their potential, we must make sure every income earner has a job that affords the family time to be a family. Does anyone doubt the relationship between poverty and poor performance in school? Children in poverty have substantially higher absenteeism and dropout rates. 40% in poverty are not prepared for primary school. They are three times more likely to have learning disabilities or developmental delays. By the fourth grade, they're already two years behind in schools, and by the time they reach the 12th grade, they're four years behind. If education is the great equalizer, and I think it is, shouldn't eliminating poverty be our top societal and governmental focus? When was the last time that a local city council member knocked on your door and instead of asking for your vote or a campaign contribution, asked you about your kids or about your job? If I was a school board member, I would be knocking on city council's door and asking them for job building help. That will improve the schools immensely. To you city council members, look in the eyes of a single parent family and tell them that this sewer line or that bike trail is more important than her child. Then look into the eyes of the child and tell him how sorry you are that you can't help because you have to make sure that parking permits are good to go for the developer who contributed so much to your campaign. Isn't it obvious where local government should spend its time? Help build jobs for people, not just jobs tied to some public mega project that will be over time and over budget and put more on an already overburdened middle class taxpayer. Help build jobs for people, not just jobs tied to some public mega project that will be over time and over budget and put more on an already overburdened middle class taxpayer, but help build jobs that bring self-respect to help that parent teach his own kids the value of what he does and help that parent say to his children, I love what I do and I want to make sure you have the same opportunities I had. So if children are our top priority, if education is an important issue, let's make sure people have good jobs.